energy is one of the greatest challenges of the 21st century. Rapid industrialization and growing population are changing the scenario of the world. Fossil fuels burnt to generate electricity and traditional air conditioning systems are additional causes of releasing greenhouse gases into our atmosphere, trapping more heat, leading to serious changes in the Earth's climate. In Saudi Arabia, where temperature peaks well over 40 degrees Celsius, air conditioning consumes up to 70% of all energy used, and power companies struggle to produce sufficient energy to meet the huge demand for cooling. There is a need for a large-scale sustainable cooling solution that is energy efficient and cost-effective. One that can reduce CO2 emissions, save us millions of oil barrels and billions of Saudi rials. The breakthrough technology is district cooling. The process begins in a central plant where water is chilled. The plant is connected to insulated underground pipes forming a primary network. This primary network distributes the chilled water to buildings. Thereafter, a secondary network in the customer's building circulates the cold water further. Air is then forced past the air site equipment to produce an air-conditioned environment, ensuring there is enough fresh, cool air but is not oversupplied. The warm water in the primary circuit is recycled to the central plant to be re-chilled. Saudi Tabrid is the leading district cooling scheme developer in the Kingdom of Saudi Arabia. The company was established in 2005 to cater to the demands of a growing population. Its objectives are an integral part of the Kingdom's holistic 2030 vision, encompassing the ambitious economic, environmental, and social agendas that are set to steer the region towards a new horizon of human progress and a remarkable deal of sustainable development. Saudi Tabrid is fully aligned with Vision 2030 in terms of economic and development objectives. Not only is it generating efficient digital cooling services, but also generating thousands of jobs for Saudi nationals. And I'm proud to be among them. Saudi Tabrid is majority owned by Vision International Investment Company, a major shareholder of Aqua Power International. National Central Cooling Company, Tabrid UAE, and IDB, Infrastructure Fund II, with the Public Investment Fund as its major shareholder. Tabrid's state-of-the-art control rooms monitors 24 hours flow of chilled water and temperature levels over a total of 72 plants and 1.4 million tons of refrigeration, all spread across the Kingdom of Saudi Arabia and the GCC providing its clients with the highest standards of quality assurance and comprehensive services, while also reducing the region's carbon footprints and energy cost by half. Tabrid's 72 plants across the GCC combined reduced over 2 billion kilowatt hour in energy consumption annually, equivalent to lighting 112,000 homes and eliminating 986,000 tons in carbon emissions annually, equivalent to removing 214,000 cars and planting 200,000 trees every year. Saudi Tabrid plants, Saudi Aramco, Jebel Omar Development Company, King Khalid International Airport and King Abdullah Financial District combined saved 1.75 billion Saudi rials in upfront capex and 2.8 million oil barrels a year. Saudi Tabrid implements the best health, safety and environmental practices. It provides the safest work environment by following international and local safety codes. The company has recently celebrated achieving more than 2 million safe working hours, free of work-related lost time injuries. In 2010, Saudi Tabrid implemented its first district cooling scheme for Saudi Aramco's Dharan office complex. The company designed, constructed, and financed the project, and today it owns, operates, and maintains a centralized cooling plant and a network to supply chilled water to the Saudi Aramco buildings. We in Saudi Aramco make strategic partnership with subject matter experts whenever possible, such as district cooling agreement to optimize our services. The district cooling agreement is based on build, on, operate, arrangement and it is different way to do business and community services. The district cooling was a great opportunity to make our young talent engaged. The district cooling agreement is a great opportunity for me and my colleagues to enhance our technical and administrative skills.
In the capital city of Riyadh, Saudi Tabrid signed agreements with Eraida Investment Company to provide district cooling services to its major projects. The first project is the King Abdullah Financial District. Saudi Tabrid implemented a district cooling scheme in the King Abdullah Financial District, which is considered to be the largest project of its kind in Saudi Arabia. Saudi Tabrid scheme capacity is 100,000 tons of refrigeration to cover the cooling needs of the entire 1.6 million square meters. Therefore, district cooling was the right choice for a sustainable and an environmentally friendly system to comply with the specifications of the green building standard implemented in King Abdullah Financial District, the largest green development project of its kind in the world. The second project is Iraida Digital City. Saudi Tabrid took over the plant's operation and maintenance early 2018 to provide sustainable cooling to this sophisticated and innovative community in Riyadh. Back in 2012, Saudi Tabrid was selected to develop the district cooling system for the Jebel Omar development company in the holy city of Mecca. The Jebel Omar district is a mega project within walking distance of the Grand Mosque of Mecca. Saudi Tabrid was selected to implement a district cooling scheme to save a total build-up area of over 2 million square meters. The network cooling capacity of 55,000 tons of refrigeration is under a concession on built, operate and transfer basis. In 2015, Saudi Tabrid signed a concession agreement with the Saudi General Authority of Civil Aviation to design, construct, and finance two district cooling plants at the King Khalid International Airport in Riyadh. Saudi Tabrid today owns, operates, and maintains two centralized cooling plants under a 32-year concession to supply chilled water to King Khalid International Airport facilities. We are proud to say that this agreement makes Saudi Tabrid the exclusive provider of cooling services to King Khalid International Airport. In 2016, Saudi Tabrid further embarked upon its developments and took over the operation and maintenance of the turbine inlet air cooling system of the Karaya Independent Power Project, the largest combined independent power generation project in the world. Located on the eastern coast of Saudi Arabia, in the harshest desert climates, the turbine inlet air cooling system improved Karaya's gas turbine's power output by up to 30% during hot summer days, while delivering a cooling capacity of 92,000 tons of refrigeration, keeping the power plant in its highest thermal performance. Saudi Tabrid brings together a powerful combination of experience, business acumen, and technical excellence all combined in a private company that not only provides an innovative service, but also invests in Saudi Arabia's future. The choices we make today will affect the amount of greenhouse gases we put into the atmosphere in the near future and for years to come. Saudi Tabrid, energy well spent.